Hi friends, I hope you're doing well. Today I'm gonna to be sharing with you guys my favorite things from the month of March. I can't believe that March is already over. This year is flying by so quickly. I actually have quite a few interesting things. It's quite the collection of products this time. Normally I stick to a lot of makeup, which I do have some makeup favorites, but I feel like this month I really focused on self-care. So there's some body products in here. I've got some lifestyle products, even some hair products to share with you. So we're gonna start off with body. I have mentioned these two products in three previous videos on my channel, three previous favorites videos actually. I think it was like last year's August favorites and then my pregnancy favorites and then the best of the year where I film like my favorite products from 2022. I featured these. This is the Necessaire, the body serum and the body lotion, which I will touch on in just a second. I'm so excited because this video is sponsored by Necessaire, which is so perfect. I have loved and used these products in my daily body care routine for months and months, you guys know. And there's actually a new product that I've been testing out for the past couple of weeks that I am in in love with. It's this right here, you guys. It's the Necessaire, the neck serum. This is so wonderful. It just takes your self-care routine to the next level. You guys know, when I've mentioned the body serum in the past, I love the idea of a serum for the body because I'm obsessed with skincare and I layer so many different serums on my face and lotions and potions. And so I've loved these products to kind of carry that same pampering down to my body. And now I can take care of my neck and kind of give it a little TLC because sometimes my face serums are a little bit too harsh, but my esthetician taught me that the neck and chest area has really thin and delicate skin. So it is important to take care of your skin in this area Area, apply sunscreen, all of that. And I just love having a neck serum now that I can use solely on my neck and chest area to really help treat fine lines, wrinkles, kind of plump the skin, hydrate it, and it's just so good. I will show you the texture. To me, it almost feels like the body serum and the body lotion combined has a beautiful, lightweight, yet really nourishing texture. The neck serum is packed with peptides, which really helps with fine lines and wrinkles. One time I was asking my esthetician what her favorite skin care ingredient was and she said peptides and I have remembered that forever because she feels like peptides just do the most for your skin. So I love knowing that this neck serum has peptides in it to really firm plump and lift the neck and chest area. It's just so nice. It also contains niacinamide and rose water. It's such a beautiful product. I like to layer this underneath lotion if I feel like I need a little boost of hydration but honestly it's really really beautiful by itself and I already see improvements in the overall feel of my skin and I also feel like the Fine lines are starting to fade a little bit, which makes me so excited to keep using this. And then just as a refresh, the Necessaire Body Serum is so gorgeous as well. It has hyaluronic acid in it. This has such a beautiful gel-like texture. I love to layer this underneath the body lotion for just that extra boost of hydration. The hyaluronic acid and the niacinamide in this product also, I've really noticed, helps with the overall tone of my skin on my body, which is really interesting. And I just feel like it makes my skin feel plump, which I love, especially postpartum, you know? I feel like I'm really Really diving back into some self-care things now that I'm more adjusted with my baby and I feel like through pregnancy I was really good at taking care of the skin on my body and then it kind of you know got wild there and now I'm back to a really consistent routine and these are my staples. The other product I love so much is the Necessaire Body Lotion. This has such a beautiful texture. This is fragrance free which you guys know is key for me not only through my pregnancy because I literally couldn't handle fragrance but after pregnancy it's been amazing too because if I want to wear a fragrance I don't have to worry about my my body products clashing with the fragrance of the body serum and the body lotion. This has such a gorgeous, rich texture, but it also absorbs so beautifully into the skin. It's not sticky either, which is so great, especially if you really wanna lather up during the daytime. The lotion also has niacinamide, which is so great, and it's packed with vitamins. It's just so good. This duo together on the body is phenomenal, and now the next serum paired with it is like everything. You can get these three products together in the treatment collection from Necessaire. You get three full size products and I actually have a code for 10% off the bundle, which is Glines 10, which I will put right here for you guys. I also have this link down below. The set is already discounted, but you get an additional 10% off, which is amazing. I love these so much. I feel like these are gonna be staples in my routine forever and ever, honestly. I haven't put these down since trying them last year and I'm so happy that my neck gets a little TLC with the serum. So if you guys wanna check it out, I'll have it in the description box down below. They're just such good everyday staples. Speaking of everyday
everyday staples, I have been really, really loving a new hair care brand, which I actually, it's funny, I didn't actually receive these in PR from the brand. I received them in like gift sets from other PR boxes, if that makes sense. The packaging is what initially like drew me to these products, but then I started using them and I love them. So I don't know if you guys have ever heard of this brand. It's Captain Blankenship. I have two products from them that I've been really, really loving. The first one being this sea salt spray. This is like really great for adding texture into your hair. And I just, I don't know, I really love it. It smells good to me. I'm just in my like mermaid era right now. <laughs> my self-care mermaid era. I don't know. I think this is so nice. And I mentioned in my last video to you guys that my hair is starting to go curly. I kind of brushed it out. So I don't know if you can tell, but there's like mermaid waves coming in. And so I'm taking full advantage of those with this sea salt spray. I just, I really enjoyed it. I feel like it adds texture to my hair, but not in a heavy way, which is really nice. And then another product I've really been enjoying from them is this right here. It's the Hair and Scalp Serum. This is so beautiful. You apply just the tiniest amount into the ends of the hair and it just adds like a boost of hydration, a bit of shine. And then also you can put this overnight in your scalp, which I've actually done before. There's been so many nights where it's like, oh my gosh, I need to wash my hair, but then I go to bed too late and I'm just really tired. And so I'm like, you know what? Let me wash my hair in the morning. But in the meantime, let me have a little scalp serum. Sit in my scalp overnight. And so that's what I do. I'll just kind of put a little bit of this through the scalp, massage it in, brush it through, and then keep my hair up through the night. And then I wash it out the next morning. And I just really like using it as both a scalp serum and then to nourish the ends of the hair, you know, after I wash my hair. So I don't know, I'm just, I'm a fan so far of Captain Blankenship, plus the packaging makes me feel like a mermaid. And so I just keep it out on my bathroom counter and I've been really, really loving these. They're so good. This product is so wild, but I love it so much. I'm telling you, I'm seriously really trying to focus on a little bit more self-care for me these days. And this is something that was also sent to me in kind of like a collective gift set in PR. It was so random. I would have never thought to buy this myself. I've actually never heard of this brand before. This is the Avant-Garde Experiment Reusable Sheet Mask. You guys, get ready. This is a reusable silicone sheet mask, which already, I know, isn't that intriguing? I'm already intrigued and I've used it before. So this is basically exactly what it says. Look how fun. Okay, so this is a mask that's made out of silicone. The color is so fun, but essentially you can turn any of your skincare products into a deep hydrating mask when you layer this on top. And I am obsessed with it because I don't use sheet masks often. A lot of times I forget to use them and I just kind of need a quick, simple routine. But there are times where I just want to like sit and add a little extra oomph to my skin. So I will add a high hydrating serum, maybe even a moisturizer or an oil to my face, really douse it. And then you apply this on top. <laughs> it's actually really comfortable as well. It has little ear loops. You let it sit and soak into your skin and it just, it's fabulous. And then you just rinse it off, let it hang dry and you can reuse it over and over again. I think it says on the back that it's also um, medical grade. Yeah, so it's 100% medical grade silicone, which is great. The only thing I would definitely want to note here is you don't wanna use like acid serums or anything that's really harsh or exfoliating with this. It's definitely something that's gonna just boost hydration. So just use more gentle serums, use hydrating serums, even vitamin C mixed in with like a niacinamide serum or something like that would be fabulous, but I just think it's the coolest thing ever. I don't know, I love it so much and it has become a favorite of mine, obviously, <laughs> since it's in my favorites video. But seriously, it's so fun. Okay, this next thing is more lifestyle, but I, this was love at first wear, I'm not joking, you guys. This is the M Cosmetics Cloud9 Daydream Eye Mask. They have a few merch items and this is their most recent launch. I am in love with this, you guys. It's an eye mask, but the best part is it's contoured so perfectly. So if you have long eyelashes like I do, or you wear makeup like I do, <laughs> I love how it looks kind of hovered like this. Anyway, if you have long lashes, lash extensions even, or you wear makeup and you have a hard time taking a nap or going on a flight or sleeping with an eye mask that smashes your lashes down, look no further. Plus guys, this is just so fabulous. The elastic back here, it's adjustable. So that's also something that like as a pet peeve of mine, I feel. With eye masks and things, I just feel like sometimes they're too tight and so it cuts off your circulation, smashes your eyelashes or they're too loose and then you can see everything and like the light still wakes you up. This also has a really nice shape along the nose. So literally 
you can't see anything. It's completely pitch black. I love this. I am so excited to take this on my next flight whenever that is and wherever I travel next because you can't always control the amount of light that comes into your hotel room and I need it to be pretty dark for me to have a really good sleep. So I just, I love this so much. You can also use it for like meditating and things like that, but I am most excited to use it on my next trip. I can't wait to take it on a plane, then take it to where I'm staying and not have to worry about the light waking me up. I'm so thrilled. So I love this so much. I actually looked at their website and it's currently sold out, but I'm sure they will be restocking, hopefully anyway, because it's just like the best thing ever. My husband actually tried this on and bought himself one. He was that obsessed. So if that tells you anything, even though it's pink, he's still gonna match me on our next trip. I am so excited. Speaking of M Cosmetics, I also tried out a new blush from them. I've actually really loved this formula for a long time. This is their stick blush. It's in a new shade though. It's called Chiffon and it is so pretty. Look at this delightful, like mauve light pink. Honestly, Chiffon is the perfect name for this. I feel like it just sounds like this color, if that makes sense. It's what I'm wearing right here on my cheeks. It's so beautiful and perfect for just a subtle, fresh face look, especially if you have fair skin. It's a very light color, but yeah, it just looks so natural on the skin. It's also like a really nice soft matte finish. It blurs the cheeks, so you kind of get like that watercolor cheek look with this. I love it so much. So I wanted to make sure to mention this. This month for me was all about self-care, body care, hair care, and bronzers. <laughs> I have three bronzers to share with you guys, which is kind of wild. The first one is this from Patrick Ta. You guys know I already really love the cream and powder duos, the blush ones especially, and then the contour and bronzer duos that he's made. But he launched a new color. This is called She's Bronzed, and the focus is just like bronze. Usually in the duos that he had previously anyway, the contour color was a little more cool tone to really sculpt and then the bronzer was more warm toned. This time you have two warm tone products. I'm wearing this all over the face. The thing I love about this is it's like a true bronze color, but even on me and my fair skin, it doesn't look over the top. I feel like it just looks like I'm sun kissed, which is so great. So I've been wearing this nonstop. I love it so much. I layer both the cream and the powder on top of each other, which I did today. And I also really love this brush. So I'll have that link down below as well. He used to only have just this right here, but now it's a dual sided brush. So you get this one for the cream, this one for the powder, and it's just a great little duo. So really been loving that. I'm craving summer if you can't tell. Between my salt spray and all these bronzers, I'm just like, I'm ready for sunshine, you know what I mean? <laughs> the next bronzers I've really been loving are from Jones Road. I really do love the shade Light Tan. It's a great bronzer for me, um, but the one that really stands out for me is this one right here. This is called Dusty Rose. It's more of like a blush color in a way, but for fair skin, it really mimics a sun-kissed look on fair skin, which is really interesting. I actually layered it on top of the Patrick Ta one and I have it applied on the back of the cheeks as well. I kept the M Cosmetics blush right here. I also applied this to the eyes, which I think looks really nice for a little sun-kissed eye look. Um, but this is like a really cool color. I don't know, I haven't really seen bronzers in this shade. And if you know, I'm pretty heavy handed with bronzers. And so if something has a little bit too much of a red or orangey undertone, you can really see it on me. And I just don't find that to be the case with this. Like it's gonna give you almost a sunburnt look. So be light handed with this. And I actually prefer to layer it over top of my other bronzers so that I kind of have a little bit of like brown bronze and pink bronze on top. But I just think it's so unique and it definitely stands out in my collection and I've been using it like crazy. So really, really love the Jones Road bronzers as well. And then last but not least, I finally got around to trying this this month and I love it. The LA Girl Matte Bronzer. This is so good. I just swirl my brush into both or actually it's kind of fun to go back and forth and use each color on their own too, especially since for really quick everyday looks, I love to use bronzers on the eyes. So I'll also use this as eyeshadow, which is really great, but swirled together all over the face, it's also incredible. Plus it's LA Girl, so it's so affordable. I have been rotating these bronzers <laughs> nonstop. I was actually giggling to myself as I sat down to film this because it was just like bronzers, like March was the month of bronzers. You can tell I'm craving summer. And while it's still snowing here in Utah, I'm just gonna fake summer with a little bit of bronzer, a little salt spray, hydrated skin, all of that. So 
Yeah, that's it for me today. I hope you enjoyed seeing some of my favorite products. Again, huge thanks to Necessaire for sponsoring today's video. It was such a dream come true, especially since I literally use these every day. I'm beyond obsessed with them and I'm so happy to have this new product added into my routine. If you've tried these, you will love this. And if you haven't tried them, you will love these. So again, I will have this trio linked down below for you guys. Don't forget to use the code GLINES10 for 10% off the set. So you're gonna get even more of a discount, which is so great. These are daily staples for me. And I just am so happy to be partnering with them on this video because there's nothing better than partnering with brands that you use on a daily basis. I just, it's a dream come true for me. So be sure to check them out. Again, I will have them linked in the description box down below, as well as everything else that I talked about today. I would love to hear from you guys in the comments what you have been loving this month because you guys have such good taste. I genuinely love to read through your comments and see what you're into. So be sure to let me know what you've been loving. And yeah, I hope you guys have an amazing day wherever you are and I will see you in my next video. Love you. Bye.